for the lay person, uh, the other report that you have given, big tech. And big tech is something that every one of us, every single person who has anything to do digitally is touched by, influenced by, uh, positively and negatively. Tell us you're the trust. Yeah, ahead, you're absolutely ahead. right, Siddharth. You're absolutely right. Big tech touches all of our lives. India has close to 700 million internet users now, uh, 350 million of them transacting on the internet. Uh, so whether it is us sitting in a city uh, or whether it is a farmer in a village uh, in Jharkhand, everybody is on the internet. Everybody's lives are touched by WhatsApp, by UPI, by digital banking. In all of these cases, uh, we have to ensure that our digital markets work in a fair, contestable way. So it's important for us to upgrade our competition law framework to ensure that they appropriately cover digital markets as well. I pointed out earlier that our competition law was amended after 15 years. And so we learned a lot in the marketplace uh, as to how competition law should be amended. And that's reflected uh, very well uh, by the government uh, in the competition uh, amendment bill. Now, equally, we have learned over the last 15 or 20 years, Siddharth, that digital markets behave very differently from traditional physical markets. So digital markets end up with winner-take-all monopolistic outcomes very, very mm. quickly. It can happen within two or three years. And that is because of the underlying reality of digital markets, where you have very powerful uh, size effects like learning effects, scale effects, and importantly, network effects as well. And because these, uh, these uh, increasing returns to size uh, move very, very quickly in two or three or four years, you can find that you can have a monopolistic winner-take-all uh, effect uh, on a digital market. And therefore, the traditional way of looking at uh, anti-competitive behavior, which is after the fact, that doesn't work very well in digital markets because these markets tip so quickly, they lead to monopolistic outcomes so quickly. So by the time you finish a five or 10-year proceeding, that market could have already resulted in a monopolistic outcome and that monopoly could have choked off all competition. So we cannot have an ex post after the fact system, which is the way traditional competition law has worked for digital markets, which touch all our lives right now. It's very important, and this is, uh, of course, the way competition law has evolved around the world as well, that instead of doing this kind of uh, regulation of competitive behavior after the fact, that we consider doing it before the fact. And this is okay. called ex-ante regulation of competitive behavior, not exposed after the fact regulation. So ex-ante regulation before the fact regulation of competitive behavior is a necessity in digital markets because they result in monopolistic outcomes so quickly. If you like the video, do like, comment, share, and subscribe.